Let me give you a quick rundown of the rules if you're new. In Wheel of 2K, I start with a trash team. Amethysts at every position. And I'll use the Wheel of 2K to add to that team. Each Wheel of 2K season is a 12 game season. And whatever record I end with will be the challenge I have to complete. Now on top of that, there are two special players in my lineup. And the first player is our team captain. This is one guaranteed stud to carry our team. And it's probably no shocker this season, Victor Wembenyama. I know it's not exactly creative, but I have never had as much fun as I had when I recorded my Victor Wembenyama video. I don't know if you guys saw it or not, but wow, it was absolutely nuts. The seven foot five power forward from France, invincible Victor Wembenyama. Not only did I actually pull him in a pack, but he has 99 in every stat. And did I mention that he's seven foot five? Now, for those of you who watched my season two where Yao Ming was my team captain, I kind of made some fatal mistakes. I basically camped in the paint since Yao was so tall and I never got good at anything else. So I promise you, as much as I might abuse Wembenyama, this will not be a repeat of the Yao season. So with Team Captain Victor Wembenyama, there's still one more player we haven't discussed. And that player is our power-up player. When our power-up player gets 10 in any stat, they're upgraded to the next best version of their card. And this season, my power-up player is Russell Westbrook. Let me tell you why I did this. Victor Wembenyama embodies everything that is cheesy about NBA 2K. I cannot say the same about Russell Westbrook. Russell Westbrook is 6'3", which hilariously is short in 2K. In in spite of this though, Russell Westbrook still has an incredible invincible card. So at some point this season, hopefully I've gone off with Russell Westbrook hard enough to have earned the invincible on the right. The road is not so simple though. There is a lot that stands between Lakers Russell Westbrook and prime triple-double OKC Russell Westbrook. First, I've got to get up to Emerald, then Emerald to Amethyst, Amethyst to Pink Diamond, Pink Diamond to Galaxy Opal, and Galaxy Opal to Dark Matter. But once I've done that, I'll get Russell Westbrook. Now keep in mind, this is 10 in any stat. So if I drop 10 points and 10 assists in one game, that's two upgrades. And the rest of the squad, of course, is just amethysts. I went with Jimmy Butler, Chris Bosh, and Dikembe Mutombo. And off the bench is Kate Cunningham, Karis LeVert, Paul George, Blake Griffin, Wilt Chamberlain. And at the 11th, 12th, and 13th man, I put three of my favorite amethysts just in case I decide I want them. And every season in Wheel of 2K, we have a spectacular franchise. And this season, to honor Victor Wembenyama for the San Antonio Slurs. Yo, a lot of my opponents probably won't even notice. They'll just kind of like see San Antonio Spurs, but me and the boys will know we're not just the Spurs. We're yes, the slurs. Sir. I've got the dope City Edition Spurs uni as my home uniform. My away uniform is the 81-89 Classics, and my alt is the 81-89 All White Classics. We've got the pink and light blue court. I cannot wait to get that court and our home unis. It's gonna look so sick. I even switched up my coach. I had Brianna Stewart as my coach for forever, but fuck women. <laughs> Am I right? You guys like yeah! so welcome boys to season four the last thing before we hop into the game and spin the wheel is of course the cheat sheet last season i landed on a 24-hour live stream this season let's take a look if i win zero games out of my 12 i'll streak at the super bowl to be honest i will win a game i might not be the best 2k player but i'll win a game one and 11 i'll wax my entire body i'll give you guys a pov i know you dirty bastards would love that two and ten i'll shave my head live Look at this beautiful hair, man. People pay good money to get my natural hair. Three and nine will get a permanent tattoo. You guys get to pick it. It just can't be like a giant cock on my face. You get it. Four and eight, I will bump the ex's group chat. I don't know if you guys remember, like two years ago, Wheel of 2K, I had to make a group chat with all of my ex-girlfriends. I still have the group chat. It just obviously isn't active. Or maybe it is and they all blocked me. Maybe they all shit talk me. I don't know. But I will shoot another text in there. At five and seven, I'll do a truth or smoke with Al. I am egregiously addicted to marijuana. I can't stop. I want any excuse. I'm hoping for five and seven. Six and six, I'll reveal my search history to all of you. And trust me, it's juicy. I don't use incognito, okay? I'm an adult. I don't got anybody to hide from. The archive has never been clean. Seven and five, record the beer mile. This has been on it since season one. I, I low-key want to land on this. You run a lap and finish a beer every lap until you finish a mile. It's kind of lit. Okay, eight and four and nine and three. I have two absolutely insane posters in my vault. I have a signed Jokic poster and I have a signed custom 
CP3 poster with his rookie cards in it. It's one of the craziest things you'll ever see. So if I go eight and four or nine and three, I'll give those away. If I go 10 and two, I will make a custom mystery box and hand deliver it to one of you. By the way, same goes for eight and four and nine and three. I'm gonna physically come to your house and give it to you. So I'm not gonna like ship it and then we just never see it. I want it to be a part of the start of season five. So it'd be really cool. 11 and one, a $5,000 charity donation and 12 and oh, NFL sweet access with my subscribers. So that's the cheat sheet. We have landed as low as five and seven this season and as high as nine and three. So that's our pretty realistic range. I won't waste any more of your time, boys. It is time for our first wheel spin and our first game of season four. Holy shit. I was so close to jackpot. That's actually still a crazy good spin. So 100K MT to spend on one player pretty much gets me anything in the game that isn't an invincible or end game. Number one, I intentionally put Victor Wembanyama at the three because I don't want to abuse him. That does mean though that my bigs, which I do use a lot, are both amethysts. So I feel like the best thing I could buy right now is probably an elite big. You know, after all that talk about a power forward and a center, I didn't like anybody. All the power forwards and centers that I like are invincibles. But there is a shooting guard that I kind of like. Grady Dick. It's actually pretty cool too. He has a dynamic duo card with Rudy Gay. <laughs> No, but Grady Dick, the six foot eight shooting guard. Actually an incredibly good card. Now, obviously he doesn't look like much compared to Invincible Michael Jordan, but that is Invincible Michael Jordan. He's still six foot eight. It'll also be pretty cool to have another super young player with Victor Wembanyama. I've made my decision. I'm gonna go with Grady Dick. So for only 13,000 MT, we get Grady Dick. I feel bad not using all 100K, but in this game, it's either a player is less than 30K MT or they're 2 million. Sorry, Jimmy Butler, but Grady Dick is in. I will move Jimmy to the bench though. So the starting lineup for our very first game is the Russell Westbrook's gold point guard card. One of the shittiest cards we've ever used. Grady Dick right next to Victor Wembanyama, Chris Bosh, Dikembe Mutombo, and not a lot of depth on the bench, but we'll make it work. Now before the game, there is the challenge wheel. If I can complete this challenge, I get one pack from the store. So our challenge is, oh no. Usually I love this challenge because it's pretty easy. Right now, we're gonna get rushed for points. Now, anybody who's new, keep in mind that in order to keep Grady Dick, I have to win this game. Granted, if I lose, I can still upgrade Russell Westbrook. I could still complete my challenge wheel. So not only are we fighting for our record, but we're fighting to keep the player we just added. You're shitting me. Yo, that's, that is so fucked up. That's crazy. Are you kidding me? Oh my God. All right, boys, we got a game ahead of us. All right, San Antonio. Let's see what we're made of, baby. Can't give up early. All right, let's get a screen from Bosh. Ignore it. Wait, is that <laughs> Gold Westbrook's already on the board. Wait just a minute, boys. Oh, he shoots at Jordan. That's not gonna go. Good board, Wemby. Let's get it to Westbrook. Out to Wembyama. Ignore the screen, and that's a that's a bucket every time for Wembyama, dude. That is too easy for him. Jordan is gonna have a field day against Westbrook and Invincible Shaq can shoot. I gotta remember that. No more freebies like that. Bring in the screen. Ignoring the screen. Two more on Wembyama. I wouldn't really say it was on Wembyama. But Gold Westbrook has four. He's, oh, no way. Oh, deep one, Wemby. Holy shit, you didn't even green that. Ah, oh, Wembenyama will take it right in. Eight to eight. We can still compete, boys. Sets the screen, kicks back to Shaq. He's got a man in the corner. Wemby on Wemby. Yup, he's gonna shoot a bad shot. Great work, boys. Matumbo with the board. Grady Dick taking it up the court. Cross right, cross left. That's a bucket. Oh, whoa. What? Matumbo on Shaq, damn. Dude, low-key, I got that Amethyst Matumbo because I figured his defense would be pretty good. But Invincible Shaq is a different animal. Oh, kick, kick, kick. Oh, that's Westbrook though. That's the only guy on this team who can't. Sh Come on, Chris Bosh, get your ass up here. Going left, he tried to just, oh, that's a bummer. Westbrook on Wemby, he almost has to, yeah. I'm about to say, it's almost like I'm not even there, huh? It's almost like I'm not even there. Ooh. <laughs> Webby's got a bucket. I've already got four with Westbrook and the challenge is very important to me. I've already got four Westbrook and Steph Curry's definitely better than that Westbrook. Granted, I still need to get at least 10 points of Westbrook if I want to complete the challenge. Oh, 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 that's a bucket. Oh, I got his ass, got his ass! Come on, oh! Oh, Chris Bosh just got dogged. Rick Smith's is wide open. Oh, it's not Rick Smith's. 
That's a shooter. Webby's got a very serious mismatch, though. I don't know who is supposed to be guarding him. That's a bucket. I know it's the Yao Ming thing, but come on. Come on, boys. Wouldn't you do the same right there? Out to Matumbo. Little pump fake. Let's get two for Matumbo. Because I got to get four with every starter. 22 to 15. High score in a game. Yeah, I got the leak out. Oh, I don't have the leak out. My defense is atrocious right now. All right, it's 24 to 15. We have a lot of defensive liabilities out there, but I think a challenge wheel and a rust upgrade are very possible. Honestly, the win is still possible. I can't give up on that quite yet. It's funny how Weapon Yama is always taking the ball up the court. I didn't really realize the game did that. Oh. Ooh, Wemby, bucket. That's deep. That is deep. Hey, you take that every time, man. I like the percentages there. Westbrook, coast to coast. Westbrook, coast to coast! Who is he? Who is he? Why is Gold Westbrook such a dog? He shoots another bad three. We got the board. You don't want this smoke, Durant. Oh, you don't want this... How did that not work? How did that oop not work? I didn't even get to hold X. There couldn't be an easier oop. Grady Dick, great cut. What is going on? Damn. Up to Grady Dick. His first bucket, potentially. Oh my God, Wemby. All Wemby Yama on that one. It's 28 to 21. I'm not even playing particularly well. It's 28 to 21. I think we go for the win. Shoots a tough three. My God, nice shot. Got him jumping into the paint. Dude, these Invincibles are playing fucking insane. Insane defense. Grady Dick is cold. Ooh, Matumbo? A layup? Too much to ask. Too much to ask out of him. <sighs> Why am I not just using Russell Westbrook every time? He's my best scorer. Clearly, he's my best scorer. Look at Russell Westbrook. This is going to be a dog shit free throw. Oh my god. What? That's as good as I'm ever going to get it. And it was 77%. 37 to 23. We are outgunned right now. We are seriously outgunned. All right. Grady Dick is sorry. I'm pulling him. I'm going to let him rest up on the bench and hopefully come back in for a better half later. Let's get a screen here from Chris Bosh. Down to Bosh. Honestly, that's exactly what I was hoping for because I don't know how I'm going to get Chris Bosh for. Let's see this free throw. Kind of slow. Actually, I actually kind of like that. And drill another. That's two for Chris Bosh, two for Matumbo. Wembenyama's got it. Westbrook's got it. We just need Grady Dick and then two more for my bigs. Matumbo? Hey! That's four points. Don't call it a comeback. That's four for Matumbo. We need two more Chris Bosh. Chris Bosh on Jordan blows right by. Chris Bosh, the ugliest shot you've ever seen. I can't say I'm too shocked. I knew this game would be near impossible with our lineup. This isn't even fair, bro. It's like a bunch of it's like a bunch of junior high schoolers out there. Oh, oh that's actually kind of clean. Dude, I gotta start Blake Griffin. Fuck Chris Bosch, bro. Chris Bosch is trash. Blake Griffin's my guy. Alright, Grady Dick gets to come back in. He breaks the wide open three. We love that. Grady Dick, pull up three. Splash! I dude, he's a white boy from Kansas. Of course, I've been using him wrong this whole time. I should have been doing that from the jump. All right, well, I got to get four for Grady Dick, too. Let's put on the spin and miss. Miss the 19% covered layup. Damn it. All right, that's okay. We're at three points. We're, we're, we're pretty much getting there. 56 to 32. Not looking good for the slurs out here, man. All right, we're, we're close. We're knocking on the door. We need two with Chris Bosh. We need one with Grady Dick. Challenge complete. And if I can get Russell Westbrook four more, he gets an upgrade. Fuck it. Chris Bosh under the- Oh my god, he just got dogged by Durant! That's crazy! He just got dogged by Jordan! Chris Bosh is ass! Oh, you're so ass! What are you a power forward for if you can't body a single guard? Chris Bosh has done nothing but get fouls. Get blocking fouls. Dude, you're so benched, Chris Bosh. You are so benched, it's not even funny. But I gotta score four points with every starter, and he is technically a starter. Ignore it. Yes, Chris Bosh! Please! Yes! Yes! Chris Bosh scored of a goaltending. All right, so Grady Dick needs a point. Keep in mind, the packs in the store right now have a 36% chance at a Dark Matter, something crazy good. So I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it now, Mr. Krabs. Hey, he's got, he brought in his gold player. He brought in a gold too. I respect that. Grady Dick. Oh, cock and balls, baby. Dick and shaft. Listen, buddy, just because you brought in your golds at the end of the game doesn't make you hot, okay? I started my gold player. This guy brings in his golds, thinks he's special. Where's Where's, where's Russell Fraudbrook? Got invincible Jordan on, on Russ, thinking you're sweet. Chris Bosh, that was the sorriest scream I have ever seen. Oh, turn around. Shooting foul. Shooting foul. All right, Westbrook, we got this. We got this. Ugh. God 
that's so dog shit. You can never understand how dog shit that is. Jeez. Well, there's no way I make a three with him, so I still gotta get back to the line. Hey, 10 points Westbrook. 10 points Westbrook. Go Westbrook! <laughs> Why is he so good? Why is he so good? This game may be a loss, but if we get one more point with Westbrook, it is a moral victory. He's packing the paint. He's leaving everybody but Westbrook. He knows. Go Westbrook. Oh, oh he almost did it. Dude, in a pack of five orange jerseys, he almost did it, but not quite. Let him have some whack-ass three. Good work, Grady. Go, Russ. We need you to get fouled, buddy. <laughs> He's getting tired. He's still at nine. I'm so close, but I'm not there yet. All right, Westbrook. Ignore it. Go! <laughs> With 26.1! Yes! 11 points for Westbrook. If you don't look at the literal score, this was a pretty good game for us for the season opener. 16 points for Weminyama on 70% shooting. 11 for Westbrook on 50%. Brady Dick, I was not very good with him. I don't care that much that I lost him. Chris Bosh is, oh. is benched 1000%. Russell Westbrook did get 11 points, which is his very first upgrade taking Russ from the 75 gold to the 80 overall emerald. He gets better in pretty much every single stat, so happy to have it. Hey, it was not that hard to drop 11 with him. I thought it was gonna be really difficult, but he's a damn, dude, he, even his gold is a damn good dunker. He was getting in there. We lose Grady Dick, but most importantly, we completed our challenge wheel. In the stores right now is the season seven super pack. Guarantees a galaxy opal, and there's a 36% chance out of dark matter. That's incredible odds for us, especially when my team is flooded with dog shit players. So for completing my challenge, I get one pack from the store. We're taking the season seven super pack, obviously. Can we go dark matter though? Is that dark matter? Oh, come on. 36%, talk to me. Looks like we also have an emerald player in there. So that's not good. I was kind of hoping to get really lucky and potentially get two good players. The important thing is the dark matter. The worst case scenario, hilariously. The worst case scenario, is that LaMarcus Aldridge? Yo! Let me tell you why that's so weird. That is so weird because the Spurs jersey that I ordered is a LaMarcus Aldridge jersey. Yo, that is so weird. Considering we're the San Antonio Slurs, that's actually such a sick pull. LaMarcus Aldridge, Dark Matter Encore. 6'11", so yeah, he's not a super meta power forward, but his stats are excellent. I'm really excited to have LaMarcus Aldridge on the squad. That is dope. We'll keep Matumbo in. Matumbo's all right. He's a little slow. And I'll move Blake Griffin to my bench power forward and see ya to Chris Bosh. We are on our way, boys. We start the season 0-1, but Westbrook's got an upgrade and LaMarcus Aldridge is locked into the team. I'm chilling. Hey, we're getting so many young players. So Grady Dick got bounced, but this jackpot is the rookie jackpot. Keep in mind, this is not the new draft class. This is not Wemby Yama's draft class. This is like rookies that were rookies this year. Yo, wait just a minute. Doesn't Boncaro have an end game? He does, right? Paolo Boncaro has an end game. It's kind of a weird weird position for us though. He's power forward, small forward, which is exactly what Wembenyama is. And I don't want to move Wemby to power forward. So damn, he has an end game, but he's literally the worst position for me. I guess I could move Aldridge to the five. I could put Wemby at the four and then Bonquero at the three. I feel so bad because he's an end game, but I kind of don't want him. Dude, you know who I do want though? I kind of want Walker Kessler. <laughs> I think I want Walker Kessler. If you guys watched my Web and Yama video, I did a whole segment on buying Walker Kessler and then uh -huh. I forgot to sub him in. He 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 landed third in Rookie of the Year voting. Endgame Paolo Banquero can sugma. I'm getting Walker Kessler. Listen, man, I already got Invincible Wendy. I already know I'm going with Walker Kessler, but the last time I used Banquero, I absolutely hated him. I know the end games are different, but Walker Kessler is gonna carry this squad to the best record we've ever had. And you can all sugma. That's that's what I had to say about that. Not only did we get Walker Kessler, we got sparkly gay pride Walker Kessler. He'll fit right in on the San Antonio slurs. All right, boys, the new lineup is equipped. This is a must win game. I am not losing Walker Kessler, not after all that. All right, next up is the challenge wheel, which so graciously got us LaMarcus Aldridge. We're 0-1. It's literally my favorite challenge on the wheel. I haven't had a lot of success with it in the past, but that doesn't make it not my favorite. Hit one buzzer beater. We have four opportunities at the end of each quarter. A shot clock buzzer beater does not count. There has to be zero seconds left and my basket goes in. All right, boys, the win 
<laughs> is mandatory. A challenge wheel and a Russell Westbrook upgrade would just be icing on the cake. He's got Lonzo, Damian Lillard, Draymond, Artis Gilmore, Sean Kemp. Nowhere near the team we faced in that first game. This is good news. Oh, he's got a Sean Kemp bucket. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Because Walker Kessler's down there, baby. Uh-oh. Is that a mismatch for the boy? Walker Kessler. Sean Kemp just banged out. Walker Kessler, three fucking weeball. Oh, God dang it. LaMarcus Aldridge, a freebie. Don't mind if I do. Throws the oop. Damn. All right, let's actually run a play. Like, let's think about this. Go LaMarcus Aldridge. Nope, don't pass it. Just go up with Russ. Ah, wait a minute. Emerald Russ. Emerald Russ has an upgrade on those free throws. That ain't bad at all. Ooh, okay, Russ. Two points for Westbrook. Gotta make some defensive adjustments. We're off way too deep. Get up in there, boys. Ignore the screen. Put up the three. Whippy! I gotta do that more. Webin Yama, big three. It's nine to 10. Emerald Westbrook playing great defense. Yo, you're fucking lying. What are we playing 21? What was that? All right, LaMarcus Aldridge, you can take one of your own. I'm not losing this game. Now with Walker Kessler. That is the greatest shot you can take, sir. Double covered in transition. LaMarcus Aldridge, mid-range jumper. It's a green. Let's go, baby. Go ahead, have that, have that. Lego, 14 to 13. Walker Kessler's got the board. Hey, what? No! Buzzer beater! Buzzer beater! <laughs> I wasn't even trying to. I forgot. Yo, I literally fucking forgot. Let's go. Yo, that is stupid clutch. Walker Kessler with the buzzer beater. The challenge wheel is complete in the first quarter. Talk to me nicely. 14 of 15, we got three assists and two points for Westbrook. Both quite nice. I'm gonna go into Wembenyama. I'm gonna get a screen from Taco. Ignore it. It's gotta be a bucket. He's so good on the baseline because his character model just kind of glitches past everybody. Three point lead. It's our biggest lead of the day. Taco fall. I am jumping like an idiot. Just put your hands up, Matt. That is so free. Thank you, sir. I'll take those three points every day of the week. He got lost in La La Land. Yup, that works for me too. Great defense. No way you make that. But I am out of position on the rebound. I'm not too mad that I didn't get that board. Ooh, that's an assist. Taco Fall, Amethyst. Let's go. Subbing in nicely for Walker Kessler. Let's go, Wemby. Let's get something here. Fine. You want to leave me? You want to leave me? I learned how to shoot, baby. Let's go. 18 to 25. Oh, leaning three. He does. Good defense. Uh-uh. Great defense. Down to Wemby. I don't know how I did that, and I didn't mean to, but I will take the two points. That is, that's not, ooh, that is gonna go. Oh, he got me. No, I recovered. Yay, let's go. I really don't want him to score here. That'll be deflating. Fuck. Livingston's on the ground. Where'd the ball go? No way you hit that. What the hell? Jimmy Butler, Amethyst for three. Oh! What is this, Jimmy Ball? You run a 2-3 zone on me? Great defense, Aldridge. I'm full of shit. That was horrible defense, Aldridge. Yes, stay out there. We're gonna keep, we're gonna keep drilling. We're gonna drill shot after shot. You wanna give it to us. That's pretty good three. I was about to say, that's pretty open. I'm scared of West. Oh, that's good. I, I switched on and got my hand up. He's not gonna hit that. Oh, Wemby. I wanted to stop and pop three. Spin and slam! Let's go! Oh, I seasoned those nuts with some Lamarcus Aldridge. I hope they tasted good in your fucking mouth. Five point lead and the starters got their energy. Wemby's a little tired. Westbrook needs to sit. Westbrook needs to come out. Damian Lillard blow by. He knows that I've got all these amethysts out here and he's He's really taking advantage of it. Weapon! Yama! Don't you dare quit. Nah, he's getting out of that 2-3 zone bullshit. He definitely just made a defensive adjustment. Oh my god. They are, he's really just blowing right, right by these amethysts. Probably should have taken that, but I just trust Wemben Yama so much more. We throw another three. Wemby's got 21. Shooting an excellent percent. This is the best three-point shooting game I've ever had. No question. Oh, Sean Kemp just got a wide open one. We'll take a brick. Draymond Green's got it, and he's swatted by Jimmy. And Wemben Yama dives. Guys, I called a fucking timeout. Why did that just happen? Screen from T-Mac, ignoring it, hitting the spin. Oh, I'm getting too spin happy. I did one cool spin, Doug, and now I can't stop. I gotta hit a three with him. 
He got him jumping. It's pretty deep. Oh, Kessler. Kessler, I need you to hit that, buddy. Come on. Oh, he's so tired. Dude, and now he's sitting and he's sitting in the crowd right now. He is very far out of position. He's gonna try and create that separation shoot of three. All over it. All over it. Oh, no way you're quitting. Let's go. Weapon Yama wasn't even in. And we got the rage quit. Oh, I wish I could have seen the box score. I have never shot threes so well. I might have been four for five or five for six with Weapon Yama. Okay, so two things just happened. Actually, more than two things. A lot of things just happened. So let me try to explain. Number one, we have a rule where if someone rage quits, I'm guaranteed an upgrade for my power-up player. That's because since he quit, I didn't have an opportunity to bring Russ back in and get points or assists with him. So first and foremost, Russell Westbrook is all the way up to the rest of the squad. He is now the Amethyst Zen Russell Westbrook. Houston Rockets Westbrook, I'll take it. Number two is we did hit a Buzzer beater with Walker Kessler. We get a season seven super pack. We will take that. Can I go back to back on the dark matters? Oh, I can't. Oh, but I think I just, I went diamond galaxy opal, which is actually really, really good. Who's the diamond? Max Strews. Hey, that's a pretty sick starter. And then whatever this galaxy opal is, Kobe? Wait, that is Kobe. No, it's not Kobe. Where is that? I thought Trevor Ariza was Kobe. I just, guys, I saw like the Lakers colors and that's actually kind of fire. Trevor Ariza at shooting guard will actually be the starter. I have never seen this card before. Trevor Ariza splash zone. A 6A shooting guard with some excellent stats. That's gonna be amazing. Starting lineup is now Russell Westbrook, Trevor Ariza, Wemben Yama, LaMarcus Aldridge, and the GOAT got among them. And then Diamond Max Struess can go at shooting guard. Starting lineup is not looking bad after game one. It's not looking bad at all. Russell Westbrook is three upgrades away from being invincible Russell Westbrook, so that's always great too. Trevor Ariza and LaMarcus Aldridge are probably not starters that will stay for a long time, and I don't have any bench depth. And there's one final thing. Whenever you force a rage quit, you get a spin on the rage quit wheel. Our rage quit wheel spin. <laughs> Two packs from the store. Dude, that's actually so OP. With how good these packs are, this is so OP. Our first pack, that's shaking a little too fast to be a dark matter. It's a Galaxy Opal, but whoever this Galaxy Opal will at least, at the very least, be a depth bench player. That looked like a fraud. It's either Dirk Nowitzki or a fraud. Like a plumber. Dude, he literally would get, he would finish a game, he would drop 30, 10, and 10, and then he would go deliver mail in the suburbs of Seattle. <laughs> Tom Chambers is six foot ten, and he can shoot, baby. So we'll take it, Tom Chambers. I'm actually gonna put Tom Chambers as my backup small, so he'll come in for Wemby Yamba, and I'll still have. I'll keep in Blake Griffin. I like Blake Griffin so much, bro. Lana Rhodes, baby daddy. By the way, anyone who didn't like my Walker Kessler pick, just know that he completed my challenge wheel, and also he's my father, and also it was the greatest pick I ever made. And our second pack. This is why you force rage quits, ladies and gentlemen. I used all my dark matter luck early, but that's okay. I'll take whoever we got. I can't be mad about it. It's definitely gonna help. Is that a center though? Was that a center? Ooh, Joakim Noah. I have heard that he is a dog. Back when I used to play 2K a lot, he was actually in the NBA and he was he was so good, especially defensively. I do remember that. I'm gonna have Joakim Noah come in at center. Blake Griffin at power forward. Tom Chambers at the three. Struess at the two and Cade still at the one. Russell Westbrook close. We got two Invincibles already going into episode two of season four. All right, boys. That was an awesome, awesome start to the season. We got a rage quiz. Let's fucking go. All right. Hey, I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.